Bemidji State University premiered their Through the Darkness Painted Hope exhibit today. Reporter Renee Morgan tells us more. The show is a collection of works by BSU alma mater, artist and illustrator Nicholas Jackson. I have a, an art show today that's uh, showing my, my paintings that I'm working on. Uh, is there some older paintings that I worked on before I had an, ar an arm injury? And then new ones uh, that have since I've kind of come back into making art, uh, art again. BSU students were in full attendance at the Tally Gallery to view Jackson's paintings on display. I'm actually a design major with an emphasis on studio art. Um, I've always been an artist, it's like a hobby of mine, and so this is actually the kind of stuff that I'm really into, and so it was super awesome being able to come down here and look at everything. Hudson Bueller says that he views this art exhibit as a learning experience. Art is very, it's very, it's very good. Um, it's not like my style, but it's, it's amazing. It's really good artwork. It's something that I can maybe take some tips from, especially like his uh, process and how he makes his artwork. Um, I think his process is really uh, impressive. Jackson also shared that despite his arm injury, he still persevered painting. You know, I, I realized and I've come to just accept that I'm an artist. At, 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 in heart, and that's who I am. And so I had to find a way to paint that didn't make my arm hurt, <laughs> and that didn't exasperate the, the issues that I had with my arm um, previously. And so oil painting just ended up being a way to do that. Yeah. Jackson shares some inspirational words for students who are looking to become artists. I would say for any artists who are out there that it's just really important to believe in yourself that you know if you are an artist to not stop. To, like there's always going to be things that prevent you from making art. There's always going to be people who don't believe in you. You're not going to believe in yourself. But this whole show is about pushing through those obstacles. Reporting in Bemidji, Renee Morgan for Lincoln News. Some beautiful artwork there. More information on the art exhibit is available at the Bemidji State University website. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.